Hello, and welcome to this tutorial. In today's video we will go through how to set up the hardware configuration for the Mitsubishi Q-Series PLC. I will make a project and add the CPU I am using. First thing I will do is to set up the connection with my PLC. To do so we click on connection destination, then on connection 1. In the setup menu we want to click on serial USB and choose the correct COM port. To find which COM port we are connected to we open up device manager. Under the COM and LPT tab I will find where my programming cable is connected. It is connected to COM port 8 so I will choose it in GX Works 2. The other setup we will leave just as they are. We can now do a connection test to the PLC. If we now go to the PLC parameter tab, then choose I.O. assignment, we can now do a read PLC data from the PLC. It will read all our modules connected to the board. We can then give a starting address to our modules. 32 points is equal to 20 addresses. And 16 points is equal to 10 addresses. So for example on my input card which have 16 input slots it will go from X40 up to X4F. And since it have 64 points before it we give it a start address of 40. And on the output module we choose start address of 50. We can now do a check test to see if there's any errors. Then click on the end button. Now let's go to the main program and add some simple coding. I got a button connected to input 1 on my module, so I will add a normally open contact with the address x41. And then a coil output that will turn on y50. I will now compile it and download it to my PLC. If I now go to monitor mode and press my button we can see that the output turns on my PLC. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.